Howdy folks, we're going to start off by looking at the hydrocarbons, which are molecules that consist of carbon and hydrogen, funny that. Um, the most simple form of hydrocarbons are the alkanes, and they follow this formula here. So carbon, N, hydrogen, 2N plus 2. So if you've got one carbon, you would have 2 times 1 is 2, plus 2 is 4 hydrogens, okay? Just a quick recap, um, alkanes containing one carbon are called methane, two carbons we've got ethane, three carbons we've got prope, four carbons we've got bute, five carbons we've got pent, six carbons we've got hex, seven carbons we've got hept, and eight carbons we have got oct. Now you're only expected to and uh, know how to draw a name organic compounds uh, with eight carbon atoms in a straight or a branch chain okay so that's as far as we need to go there's a really bad texture and I'm going to change to another color that you can see So, um, we're going to start by drawing the straight chain alkanes. Um, we'll, we've done methane before. Um, follows the formula CnH2n plus 2, so methane having one carbon will have four hydrogens, and they're just drawn around the carbon like this. Okay, so methane has the formula of CH4. Um, if we look at ethane, we've got two carbons. All right. Therefore, we have got 2 times 2 is 4, plus 2 is 6 hydrogens. Okay, and they're just evenly dispersed around each carbon. Now, Hydrogen is a place like this because each carbon needs to have four bonds um, to have a full outer shell of electrons. Okay, um, a simpler way to write something like ethane and the way that I'm going to get you to do it from now on is like this because it saves space and time. We're going to go CH3 bonded to CH3. And that'll be ethane. Now if we want to go a bit further, let's choose something like uh, pentane or butane. Let's go butane. Then butane has got four carbons. So C4, H2 times 4 is 8, plus 2 is 10. So we're looking at C4H10. We need four carbons. Okay, now the carbons on the end have three hydrogens and the carbons in the middle have two hydrogens because they already have two bonds attaching them to the carbon on either side. So that is what butane would look like. If we count up our atoms, we've got one, two, three, four carbons and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten hydrogens. Okay, um, as you can imagine, as you increase the number of carbons and follow the formula, you will just continue adding CH2s in the middle and cap both ends with a CH3 until you have your required number of carbons. So octane, for example, C8H, 2 times 8 is 16, plus 2 is 18. Right, so we need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 carbons. 
the ends have CH3 and all the carbons in between are CH2 and connect them up with a bond and there you have it C8H18 I think you can't quite see that one, it's chopped off on the end there but that's a CH3 okay now that is pretty much straight chain alkanes and naming them. Just remember meth, eth, prop, bute, pent, hex, hept, oct.